Hi guys. Um, you asked me how to crack how to crack your hip joints, and um, hips aren't really um, about cracking too much. It's more about um, freeing up restricted range of motion by mobilizing them. Uh, usually, that's uh, more effective. And the first thing to do then would be to sit like this. So you have the the leg of the hip that you want to mobilize in a 90 degree angle and the first step is to um, just try to sit like this without, uh, without your hands and then you can reach over to this side and usually you feel like very tight in the hip here. So that's a mobilization exercise, also good for squatting. Um, and then you just go to the other side and maybe one hip feels tighter than the other. So this is a very good um, exercise to mobilize the internal rotation of your hips, which is mostly um, uh, the most restricted. And then if you still feel your hips are tight and you want to um, uh, try to crack them, you can just lie on your back and then push your heels forward like um, one after the other. So your heels go like this. Let me just try. So sometimes um, you can crack them like that. For me, it doesn't work at, at the moment. The second uh, thing you can try if you stand with your feet parallel is to swing like this and kind of feel the rotation uh, in your hips and then oh there it was actually the left one just popped and um, if you still feel you, you can't quite get it yet what you can try is very slightly, but be careful with this, very slightly um, put your feet on the inside there and then just there. Swing to, swing to this side and then the other one so you can um, correct your hip joints. Hope that helped. <laughs> um, but the Mobilization exercise is probably most important. So uh, it's a good warm-up exercise for squatting or, you know, running, whatever. Bye-bye. <laughs>